Here's a very cool feature you can introduce to your glass, and that is ability to add as well as swap out different normal maps. So here I have clean glass, and I already have my material set up, and here's my material instance. And within the material instance, I have the ability to change out the normal map. So at the moment, its intensity is set to zero, so I'm gonna turn it on, set it to one, and it begins to display the default normal at its full default intensity. And because I have it enabled as a property, as a parameter, I can switch out this normal map to anything else. And all I have to do is choose a different normal map. Let's go ahead and choose the second one and swap it out to see a different glass design. Then I have a third one, fourth one, and more, and you can swap out to any normal map that you have that you'd want to use. And it's one of the best ways to introduce some glass design into your material. And the setup for this is very simple. Here are the normal map controls. And at the moment, we can ignore all of these. These are intensity controls. And here's the normal map set up as a parameter. So all you would do is drag any of the normal maps into the material editor for your glass. Right click on it, convert to a parameter, and then name it anything you want. And then named mine normal map. And then simply connect the RGB of this normal map, which is now a parameter, which will be exposed inside the material instance, into the normal map input. So let me go ahead and bypass everything and just drag it into the normal map input. And here's the simple setup that you would need. And now this becomes a parameter where you can switch out to a different normal map inside the material instance. And this is what now allows you to change to a different normal map for a different glass design. And if you want to learn more how to set up this advanced glass material using normal maps, intensity controls, as well as tiling controls for your normal map, and the entire glass material that's more advanced that allows you a lot of customizations for it. Take a look at the full advanced glass tutorial for UE5.